with it. I actually protected something. That's pretty neat. I was like, why? I mean, he wasn't about to die, but okay. I like that when that happens, though. What? Did you... What do you mean shit? That's not even proper Chinese coffee. But anyway. Gensha. That's a train. Game is the word for turtle. I guess it could be God Turtle Train. I play a game like that, that name. Uh, let me go ahead and use. I could use a tofu against this. Uh. uh. Tofu. tofu. We do have a lot of restrictives. Oh gosh, what is that? That looks intimidating. I'm coming back later. I think that's a joke about how like, it's not supposed to be Chinese. Oh, I guess, I guess in Japanese it's technically like, I don't know actually. Oh, zombie kid! Oh no, zombie kids! No! Stop it! Oh. Zombie kids. Oh, I don't have enough for this. I'm running. Also wanted to heal her spiritual energy before I forget. That's why I ran away. I'm like, oh, she doesn't have any spiritual energy. Oopsies. I think of all things, that's actually not the one. Oh, I guess if they were translated to English from. Yeah, that's that's kind of like that's why I'm like, wait, they don't usually. If they're gonna rip off something, usually they keep its Chinese name. It's okay. I I, I got you. Shen. Uh, uh, there's a door here behind it. I don't really know. Oh boy. Thank 
thankfully the enemies here are pretty slow, so it's not too bad to deal with them. Alright, let's deal with uh, just a few monsters on your own. Zombie kids. Well, these are just spirit... Spirit children. Alright, we'll fight them again. Ow! Okay, so... I want to... Uh, you can try attacking the zombie kids. They have counter? No, they don't have counter. That's good. Wow. Nice. Oh, nice. She used protect. Nice. Nice. On the zombie kids. I ran from the battle. Really? Oh, good block. Seriously. Oh, uh, no. Stop it. Stop it. That's called the blood, uh, blood sucking technique. Strangely, it does not actually heal them, so it's kind of weird. Yo. Okay, that should not be enough. Okay. Okay, game. I see how it is. Can you please kill that zombie kid? My god, they have a lot of HP. Uh oh. Uh, the battle almost killed you. No, I just did not have enough spiritual energy, so I wanted to run away, heal up, and then come back into the battle. Oh, geez. Yeah, healing might be a good idea. Nah, uh, there's not enough time to do. Yeah, see, she would, she would, it would have been over if she had not healed herself. Ah! I was right. I think I'll just want to make it for you uh, then on the left. I want to see what happens if I use that technique. Long star style. Theoretically, they should hit that. Nah, I can't even kill a zombie kid. kind of dead, so... Just... Just kill them. Just kill that zombie kid. Really? Still? Man, they have so much HP. Please. Wow. Oh my gosh. Really? Oh no. Oh, because they get, keep getting healed too. That sucks. This, this is a really annoying battle. As long as you keep those things alive, they're gonna keep. All right, I, I, I gotta deal. Well, let's kill the zombie kid first. I think I made a mistake. I should have gone for the spirits first and then for. Her. They don't really look dead. I'm not dead. Okay. Thankfully, don't. I think the spirits aren't too dangerous because they don't have any other attack other than just physical attacks. And otherwise, they'll just keep killing themselves. Wow. Yeah, that's the only thing they can do directly you, is to hit you in the face. Alright. Um, I'm just gonna use. Shoot. I got attack. Wind isn't gonna be very useful against them. job is to heal them now. Well, we might as well use those shoulder pills. Yeah, because like we were getting a bunch of them earlier anyway, so might as well, right? There's no point in saving it. Don't use them all, but... Okay. Fine, whatever. Uh, some ice, please. Ooh! I think when that happens. 
Yeah, these are really... Every enemy here is really annoying. Oh, I like how you use the word lock Y, which means the full... Alright, level 19 for Tianhe. Cool. Oh, lots of stuff for getting the three-star battle. Ooh. Okay, yeah, she's about to die, so... I'd like to heal her, thank you. Oh, yeah, you have no spiritual power right now. 2286. Two, two, Tofu? Nah, I don't want to use that. Mouse food. Inching closer to that level 20. Oh my gosh, so painful. Why is everything in this dungeon so painful to deal with? Like, this this dungeon has no chill. Uh, I could use a tofu, oh my god.
right, Ming Sha is getting pretty close to that level. Oh, let's see, what do I want to do? They're on the stick. Well, I think they're just reanimated like one of those horses, toy horses. I mean, he's not going to use his magic that much, so. I would really suck. Oh, I think we can get out of here. Oh, I think we can get out of here. We've walked in this tomb for so long, and but other than ghosts and monsters, we haven't been able to find. We have not been able to find any other clues. Molly, don't be afraid. You look at this tomb closely. In the tomb, there are ten doors. There are big ones. Molly, don't. You don't need to be in the be in a rush if we if we carefully examine this this rear palace. There's a high chance there might be some big secret in it. I like how it says like this is actually an expression called eight and eight or nine out of ten. There's an eight or nine out of ten chance that there's hidden uh, there's a secret hidden here. But yeah, it's just really interesting. Maybe I should have just said that. Like, there's an eighty or ninety percent chance that there's going to be a big secret in here. Looks like I've been progressing the right way. So. 有吗？长得和其他房间差不多呀。Is there? It looks like it's just like the all the other. It looks about the same as all the other rooms. Lingsha, you are saying that there are no ghosts? Lingsha, are you talking about the fact that there are no ghosts or monsters here? Good job, Molly. Still, you're smart. Hehe. Good job, Molly. Ah, you really are smart. I was just going to take the key to the Great Wall to the Palace of the Great Wall. I didn't see it. But now, when I went out, I thought it was strange. Let's I guess like the past few times that I <laughs> past few time sorry the past few times that I entered into the maus the royal mausoleum of King Huai uh, of Huai Nan I didn't really take a good look but now there are <laughs> there are monsters <laughs> there are ghosts there are ghosts appearing sorry there are ang there are angry ghosts malevolent ghosts appearing now <laughs> only now do I feel like it's strange or like what is it. It's like only after the ghost appeared did I feel like this place was really strange. There you go. Am I right? I read this right, right? I don't know anymore. It's okay. Let me just. Ah, Li, say, no. Ghost,属阴寒而未阳。陵墓入口处被我挖了个大洞，生气泄怒，鬼当然都不敢靠近。就不晓得这后殿没鬼是怎么一回事。That's a good point. I don't see how else you can translate that. I don't know. I get, I'm get scared now because I'm like, because sometimes they have like very odd, um, like, cause like sometimes I misinterpreted it before, so I just wanted to be absolutely sure. You gotta have it rock solid, you know. Okay, got it. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, that's a good point. Oh, I see, I see. I... Oh, thank you. I was actually gonna... I actually looked it up and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> According to the principles, ghosts belong... Are, are of the cold and... <laughs> Cold and dark, and they fear the <laughs> fear the light. I guess like fear yang. Sorry, cold and yin. They they're of the cold and yin element, and of course they fear yang. Yeah, yang and yin are like two living are like living in negative energy, dark and light. But that's you guys know about yin yang. Yes, that's how that's how it works. Anyway, let's see. I <laughs> I made a. I dug a big hole in the entrance area to the mausoleum, and so living air, living air was able to enter in. Of course, ghosts would naturally not be, not dare get near there. I don't know why this rear pal. Oh, I think it's like rear palace. No, I think it's like rear room or rear hall. There you go. I don't. Let's see. I'm not sure why this rear hall has no has no ghosts in it. Yeah, I know. I don't know why there are no ghosts in here at all. That's a Look! It's a... Those are toads! There's two of the toads! There's two of them! Oh, whoa, he actually ran, ran up there. Oh... Oh, I, I don't know if I should translate it. I would break someone's heart. I'm just joking. Uh, let's see. I just need to... Anyway. Sorry, just needed to... I wanted to know how... I wanted to remember how to pronounce that. Cool. Toadies! Let's see. They're just toes. They're so gross. What are you shouting about? Uh, what are like? Are they really worth shouting about? I guess she doesn't really like toads. Oh, toads are cool. They sometimes have mushrooms. Oh. oh, so it's a different type of different type of toad. I guess what, like, they're like the, in mythology, they're like three-legged toads? Interesting. I did not know they were a creature, so they're special to me. I remember, anyway, Mungli says, like, I remember reading in the book that these toads are called the Chan Chu, um, and they're supposed to be auspicious creatures. Um, nor a nicer way to totally, yeah, they're just toads. But like they can refer to a three-legged one that's on the moon apparently. But yay, toadies. Nadal是，嫦娥奔月飞升成仙，月亮里就有着很大很大的蛤蟆，所以这丑东西也变得讨人喜欢起来。Oh. Oh yeah. So well, it's as I said. It, these are toads from. They're also used to refer to that giant toad in the moon. Anyway, let's see. Oh, thank you for translating. I figured it out. But anyway, that's right. Legend has it that the <laughs> that Chang'e, that's the the maiden on the moon. That Chang'e, uh, let's see. Oh, thank you. Chang'e flew it toward the moon, and then let's see. That Chang'e went toward the moon and flew to become an immortal. Oh, like, sorry, let me go ahead. Actually, I think the way you have it is better. Let's just say that when Chang'e flew to the moon and to become an immortal, on the moon there was there was a big toad. And so that's why these ugly things became became so well liked. I know. Oh, toads are not ugly. What's wrong with you, Ling Sha? Lowered expectations. I'm just joking. So Chang'e is a uh, yeah, Sana is like a really, really old legend. We that's why we joke about the that there's a that for Chinese these people are like oh yeah there's a whoop oh Chana she's on the moon. I don't know why they didn't discover her when they when they actually landed there.
And yes, thank you for explaining the story of Tala. I sometimes even I forgot a little bit about it too. It's been so long since I read about that. 据说淮南王生前笃好寻仙修炼之术，最后同八位老者服食仙丹而飞升，八公山也因此得名。不知是真是假。Yeah, I know. Is it real? Huh? Let's see. I just need to look up this word in particular. Oh, fond of? Oh, thank you.、Uh, how do you actually pronounce that? It's okay. I did. Sometimes it's like they talk a little fast. Also, this music is also like makes makes it hard to hear them sometimes. I should maybe lower down the music in comparison to the voices, and that might help me. Anyway, so I heard that King Kuai Nan, when he was alive. Had a great interest in finding,、uh, like, in finding arts. Sorry. In uh, let's see, in finding techniques that were cultivated by immortals. In the end, let's see. And in the end, he, together with with eight elders, ate ate the immortal pill and then flew. And so that is why the mount, this mountain of the eight elders, like it's called the Bagong Mountain, which we called it earlier, but this mountain of the eight elders received its name. I'm not, I'm not quite sure if that was, if that is true or false. Yeah, no, I might have to lower down the music in comparison to the voices. Fond of fighting cultivation techniques that can grant immortality. Oh, I get it now. Sorry. Xian Xiu Lian Zi Su. I see. So it's finding techniques to cultivate immortality, not finding techniques that were cultivated by immortals. Curses. Passive voice is confusing. But anyway, thank you for correcting me. Everyone wants immortality. I mean, Qin Shi Huang. We're not going delving into Chinese history. Let's keep moving. 天知道呢，反正我进他的民宫看过，那老头的棺椁里没有尸骨，说不定真的变神仙去了。嗯 ，Yeah, maybe. Oh, heaven knows. In any case, I even entered into his <laughs> his resting chamber and to take and looked. Let's see, inside the coffin, inside that old man's coffin, there wasn't even any any corpse or bones.、Uh, who's to say that maybe he really did become an immortal? I know. Hmm. That's good. That's interesting. A coffin with no bo no corpses or bones in it.、Hmm. 你们看这两只蛤蟆，用的玉也不同，左边的是红玉，右边的是黄玉，我猜是分别对应日中赤气上黄真君，月中黄气上黄神母。<笑>太阳月亮都到齐了，可不正是暗合仙籍典故里常说的阴阳顺调，天人合一？啊，因为有风水。I'm like, oh, I have to translate all that. Okay. So anyway, no one was able to translate the anthology that this came from. Um, yeah, she's just me. I think, in short, it just means that red, crimson responds to the sun, and yellow responds to the moon. Now, allow me to explain. Let me translate this early part, and then the rest is like whatever. It's not really that important. She's just making observation. So anyway. See, look at these two toes. The jade you used to make them were is completely different. The left one is made of red crimson jade, and the right one, the right one is made of yellow jade. I think it's because of the, <laughs> because of the,、uh, it's just that thing where it's that thing. Red Zhong He Qi Shang Huang Zhen Jun. It's sort of like something like it's like. Within the sun, there is like this red aura that is corresponds to the emperor and a and the true king. And the other one is like the moon. Within the moon, there is this yellow aura that corresponds to the <laughs> the yellow goddess. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Let's see.、Uh, when you say she says 太阳月亮都到齐了 you mean like the when the sun and moon have are become Become straight. Let's see. 